Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Tia at B5 Designs, and I am back to show what I picked up at Michael's earlier this week. Uh, I was worried that um, they would sell out of their Halloween stuff. Um, Michael's here in my town is just kind of, I don't know. I don't know if other towns have a lot more or a different variety of selection. We don't seem to have a whole lot. Um, but like I said, I'm not sure. And I just was worried that they wouldn't um, keep these in stock for very long. So I ran while they were on sale and I picked this up and this being the Recollections stickers. And again, most of this stuff will be used in uh, well, probably card making and some scrapbooking, but as I've said, I'm really into this junk journal thing that I have going on, which I'm going to work on that a little bit tonight. I kind of started in August, even though it's September, and because August is my birthday, and we did have some family events that I want to do pictures of. If you hear little pitter-patters, that would be my dogs. So that is that. And it doesn't really show anything on the back, so I'll just do a quick flip through. I think that my grandson would really like these. Um, he kind of likes glittery and, you know, foily stuff, which, you know, of course kids do. So, but I thought this was cute. Little tags. I love when you get the little washi strips. I think those are cute. And then there's these. And then some bigger little kind of like journaling. And then there's some ghosts. And I think I said this in my other video and probably other many other videos. I don't really like the spooky, creepy Halloween. I like the cutesy. So there is that. And then I went ahead and picked this up. And this is literally just three die cuts. And it was $2.99, but it was on sale. And then um, it ended up being $2.39, I guess. Whoopee. Uh, with my 20% off. I think that's funny. I saved $6.90 at Michael's. Sorry, I'm trying to get this open. Because I'm not 100% sure what the three are. So you get a bat, a ghost, and a cute little pumpkin. And... Those would be cute on a card. You guys are going to get sick of me. Junk journal, junk journal, junk journal. But um, I'm hoping, I have 3D weekend, so I'm hoping that I will have time to do some fall decorating. And lots and lots of crafting. So I did pick up this Happy Halloween uh, scrap pad. I don't have a lot of Halloween. In fact, I can only think of one. And... I'm sure everybody's seen this, but it was $14.99 with 40% uh, off, so I got it for $10.49, and I will do, always think I'm prepared. I don't really know sometimes if I should do flip throughs because I know things like this, you know, a lot of people are, are posting, but um, we all have different tastes, and um, you know, do pick up different, different things. Like I said, some people like the spooky creepy and that's cool. That's just not my vibe. I mean, I think a lot of it's cute. Not, I think a lot of it's nice, but it's just not me. So this one is, this is a nice, for the amount of money I paid for it, I think it's pretty nice, you know, for 10 bucks to have the foil in it and 
looks like you get two of those and then you get some card things. I was, ugh, sorry. That's kind of hard to do a flip through. And then you get this page. Problem is that my desk is kind of crowded. I have th things out that I'm working on and then stuff that I plan to work on. And then this one is foil with the bats. And then my junk journal stuff, this I thought was really nice, really nice good full page of cutouts. Maybe fun in a planner or a junk journal. Yep. Can't have a video without dropping something. Um, anyway, my junk journal stuff I work on in the dining room while I'm watching TV. But I primarily, I prefer to craft in here in my craft room. It's a cute page. But I do sometimes craft at my dining room table. Actually, right now I have a bunch of my jewelry making stuff at my dining room table. That's foil. This is a cute page, too. Um, and then this one. I'm not crazy about that. Do you guys ever have, like, certain color combinations or just shapes or patterns like this kind of makes me nauseous. I don't know if that's weird or what, but <laughs> I've been that way since I was a little kid. Like when I played with Barbies, I'd be like, oh, I don't like that because it makes me sick to my stomach, the clothes. Anyway, so I am going to come back at you with my Hobby Lobby because I'm trying to keep these a little bit shorter. Um, and it is a Clarence Hall, and I do talk a lot, and I didn't get a ton, but I will be right back.